guys are right now registering for the USA powerlifting get all that done paying my $45 for the I'm gonna be in the junior from 1923 and open class I'll show you guys Good enough for me. I'm going to go take some pics. The sun is setting, so alright, so it's not focused on me right now. But the sun is setting, so I need to find a spot to go to. I'm either gonna go to the place I went to last time, um, or a new place. I'm gonna try out the new place right now. See if anyone's there. If no one's there, it'd be perfect because it's um, really cool with the lighting of how it's sunsetting right now. So I'll get back to you guys later. I'll either be uh, by the factory by my house or I'll be um, near the bay. So both will be really cool pictures. And stay tuned. I'm going to be right back in three. <laughs> All right. Not good at math, but I am genius. Three, two, one. All right, so we're here. Uh, where I live, this is called the Bridge to Nowhere. There is a bridge down the end. Uh, it ended up getting torn down because they built they built a new bridge. Uh, I'll show you a picture of the new bridge, and it's really just a straight road. Uh, it's really an abandoned road. There's really nothing to it. Uh, we have the bay on one side, and we got the bay over here. It's really cool. Only problem is here, there's a shit ton of bugs. And I have bug spray, but they're like some big ass bugs that's just flying around. And greenheads, they'll give you a nasty bite. So we're going to try this out, it's going to be quick because I do not want to get eaten alive. This is the makeshift tripod, spongy. Oh. So that's the, the bridge all the way down there. And so this is the road. Yep, so it's literally just long ass road all the way down there it's like the the so called bridge and then we spin around here just keeps going we'll try to get a cool shot going this way and we got a storm rolling into that so let's make it quick Storm. Let's see if we can see it. I can't really see it now. These bugs are getting me. Sixth storm. But uh, trying to get some few pictures. Took um, pictures are just around here, out there. Getting some cool pictures, surroundings. Really nice place to take pictures. But I'm gonna try to get a few of me and then be out. Alright, so that concludes the pictures for today. Uh, actually, it might not because there's a cool storm coming in and I might try to get a, like a lightning shot. Cool, right? But uh, I'm going to try and see if I can do that. See if I can even see the storm because I know this, this lens doesn't really work too well in low light. But uh, also another thing, when I was dancing in the middle of the road, there's a car coming. A little weird, a little awkward. A little embarrassing on my part. That camera ain't moving. That tripod ain't moving. I tell you what. I tell you what. There's nothing that's gonna make that tripod move right now. Woo! We're gonna mud him with this thing. I always just end up talking like that.
when it's this when it's this quiet out, I usually do a lot of thinking. And something I've been thinking about recently is uh, there's not a lot of leaders out there, a lot of followers, and it's okay to be different. You know, you don't want to walk around and thinking you have to be like everyone else and do what everyone else is doing, because we lose the originality out of that. You know, you want to be your own person. You want to show people who you are, because that's what leaders do. They show people who they are. You know, when everyone's doing this, and you choose to do this, that just makes you different. It makes you special. It gives you originality. And we kind of lose that because everyone's trying to fit in. Everyone's trying to be like that person. Like, oh, that person looks great. That person's fit in. They're fitting in. They're fitting in. You know, I want to be like them. You know, just don't. I find that so confusing. I see someone trying to be like someone else, or trying to fit this role, and really they lose the, like, they lose who they are. You know. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm showing you guys who I am with this camera, showing you what I do with my life. Um, what I do lifting wise and you know it's turning me into a different person you know, it's showing me that showing other people who I really am because I usually would not do that uh, I was a little shy growing up so doing this right now has really opened my eyes and helped me change my life for the better so just letting you guys know show people who you are be a leader don't be a follower and it'll lead to great things Alright, this will probably conclude the video for today. Just want to show you guys, like my Sunday, take pictures, you know, do a little thinking. Uh, really have a relaxed day. Didn't do much, didn't lift. I'm going to start lifting tomorrow, which is Monday, do some deadlifts. Uh, I have work tomorrow night, so I'm going to show you the deadlift part of me in my morning and what I do. Um, I will be doing that eating challenge for my 100 followers. I know, big accomplishment. 100 followers on Instagram. Thank you guys so much. Um, so I'll probably be doing the 50, I'm actually going to do 50 chicken fries from Burger King. That'll be my eating challenge. I might be able to do more than that. I might, I might actually get more than that if I'm feeling it. But uh, that's what I'll be doing sometime this week. Probably Tuesday when I have time. Don't have any work or anything. But uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Got some pictures today. Uh, this is going to be the end of today's video. Uh, this will either be a two-part video or just be a one-part video. Uh, I'm probably going to make it two parts just because today was very short. Didn't do much. Just took those pictures. So, again, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys later.